whenever we are playing a game we see a lot of progress bar on the game scene uh, it can be like health bar ammo bar and many more right now i will show you how easily you can make a progress bar in unity using dutoin as you can see it's an empty scene okay for progress bar we need to first make a ui for showing the progress okay so let's make it uh, let's first take a canvas so that this will be screen size then we want to declare a image and this one is just for the progress holder progress holder and it should take around like first we are making a horizontal uh, progress bar first so let's make it 500 and width and height 100 is okay and keep it middle then we don't need to sh show it that's because it's just for holding purposes and nothing else first uh, take an image and this one is for background it will take the full stretch and then another one for fill image now uh, as you can see it's not showing any option that's because we, we didn't assign any sprites to it but so I already have some sprites on my project you know here so it's just a square nothing else first assign to here and see uh, it's showing simple first uh, we need to change the image type to field and as you can see there are many options for like uh, filling uh, and we are making horizontal right so we are making it something oh also we need to change the color so you can see let's do this one okay oh it's working okay nice uh, now uh, we just need need a script that goes from 0 to 1 let's create a script first uh, script folder progress bar manager and let's assign it to image uh, I mean the progress holder by the way I'm using the rider for my script editor but you can use like uh, visual studio visual studio code uh, anything you like actually so uh, next we need a method for updating the progress value let's just call it update progress value and we are using dot win with uh, lambda expression okay and if someone doesn't know what dot dot win is it's just a tuning library and you can get it from unity assets store for free uh, yeah and uh, also i'm using it that's because i just need to write uh, just one line of code and that's it the progress bar works i don't have to use like uh, update code in uh, anything else okay so let's go from here first one and then we need to get the reference for fill image public image fill image now fill amount uh, fill amount is the value the slider value okay and this expression is just for getting the current value and then variable fill image the fill amount equals x and this one is for like updating the progress value we need another variable for like target value Tar target value and one for animation duration animation duration <laughs> let's first declare the target value first Put 
festival and animation direction uh the animation direction is like uh we got want to go from zero to one or zero to point five or something uh so how long it it will take the animation will take uh, so uh, let's uh declare it on the spectros so we can easily change it animation duration from here okay now if we call this method from start it should work let's say we set go to target value to one go to one okay now first we need to assign the variables first uh, first one the fill image this one is a fill image and the animation duration let's say five now we also need to fill image value to zero so you can see what happens if we go now you see it's working perfectly now we also want a text in the middle showing that it's going from zero to hundred percent okay so first take one text let's call it uh progress text and uh, it's not showing up that's because we need to change the color of the text uh, center it first and then change the color to something like green or something mm, yeah then it work bold and auto size like say 50 uh, we want to show it like 0 percent to 100 percent hundred okay first let's keep it empty next we need the reference for the text we just declared public tmp text um, we need to assign it for uh, then focus the holder go from progress text done now we are to up we want to update the text value uh, in dot we can uh, we can easily do it um, easily do this you know let me show you on update it's also a lambda expression to update the text equal to fill image dot fill amount equal to percentage it should update the value now uh, see what happens you see it's working but the text value going from 0 to 1 so we need to multiply it uh, with 100 that's because we want to show 0 to 100 percent into 100 okay we also want to do cast that's because it will show uh, the float numbers let me show you uh, if we want to change now the value going from 0 to 100 correctly but it's showing the float values so, but we don't want the float values so let's cast it to int now it should work perfectly see it's working perfectly okay uh, so this is the uh, as simple progress bar with dot win as you can see we just need to like just one line of code uh, one line, actually three line because there's spaces but it's just really easy to use like dot win um, you know you don't have to consider update code or anything uh, let me sh uh, let me just uh, show you another example of it let's say we made a horizontal one right let's make a circle that because it's really popular So we need to change the uh, let's change the position first. Yeah. Background we don't need anything on the background, but it's a circular, so let's keep it like four hundred and four hundred. Uh, not this one. We need to change the holder first. Four hundred and four hundred. Okay. Then we need to assign the circle run i have i don't have a circle but i have a 
this one so it should uh, it will work and the field image should also have one here and 0 to 1 let's see how it goes oh it's going horizontal okay so we are making a, uh, a radical one right so we need to use horizontal uh, yeah, from field methods okay we need to change here to radical 360 that's what happens uh, we go from 0 to 100 yeah it's working perfectly now also you need to change the text uh, okay we need to change i think it will work perfectly and uh, that's it that should work here okay play now you see it's working perfectly okay it's fun uh, uh, let's make another one <laughs> uh, so let's take a declare one and change it to like say vertical vertical we want a vertical one and go from 50 to 40 and second one background to we use the circular one and uh, this we also need to assign the field image and also it's important we need to change the field method uh, change the fill method field method actually <laughs> field method to radical to vertical okay so if we go now it's working perfectly we need to change the text a bit i think yeah like this is triangle we need to change a bit um, here go from uh, here and here to here so now if we play it uh, it should work okay for the field image should be zero and now yep these are the simple uh, progress bar you can make easily with dot in i hope you have enjoyed the video if you have please leave a like and subscribe you can watch this video on the screen where i created a simple script to make the necessary folders for a consistent project folder structure and lastly thank you guys for watching and have a nice day bye bye